Hello world, Cal back again with another Minecraft video. Oh. Hello sheep. Uh, I know it's been a while since my last one. Quite a while, I think it's been like eight, nine months now. Could have had a whole child in that time. But I'm back, I just released uh, a little tour of my old world, if you guys saw that. Thank you guys for checking it out and showing me so much support even though I haven't been active. You guys got me all the way to over 100 subscribers, which I'm going to do something special for you guys because I can't believe I got over 100 subscribers already. But welcome back to the base. Not much has changed here. We still got Spawn Tower looking beautiful as ever. We got our 10 year sign and our little pillars. Uh, we got our tree farm over there, our wheat farm over there. And this is our base right here, which leads down into the bottom portion of it. And I figured today we'd start working on the outside of my base. Now, I was originally going to keep this pretty simple because we just don't have that many blocks given to us during these these uh, old days of Minecraft. But I figure why not? I already have some ideas with this. and I don't even like how this looks currently, mainly these pillars. I want to kind of keep them, but I want to like convert these into towers. So we're going to try to break one down and do a test run on it and see kind of how it looks. Uh, we'll probably do this one. So this is obviously still the same world. Uh, we're still playing on hard. And this is still the same version that we left off on. So this is infdev 2010-0630. Uh, I don't plan on upgrading alpha anytime soon there's still a lot i kind of want to complete on this base and sort of this part of uh, my let's play before i decide it's time to upgrade so we're going to go ahead and take down this pillar and i'm going to go see if my tower idea that i kind of want to do on the four sections of this base i want to see if that kind of works out now it's going to mess with the shape a little bit i have like kind of a circle shape going on right here but i think it's going to look better if I change these to like small little towers and this is why you always you know test things out because I built up the tower here kind of off screen and I didn't really like how it looked so I went ahead and uh, I went ahead and broke it down again and I think how did how did a pig die here where did you come from did did, did you fall from the sky Anyways, uh, so I think we're going to keep these and keep this little design. And I think we're going to kind of connect them up. Cause I think that's what missing. That's what's missing with them is that they're not connecting up right now. And I think we're going to have them connect up to something in the middle. So I'm going to go ahead and build up and see what it looks like. So guys, I went ahead and build up these. Uh, I went ahead and connected everything up. I took down like the top tower part. And now I think we got we got something going here. I'm not too sure why I have these going down the side right there. I'm not too sure if I'm going to keep them. But let me just collect some of these blocks up real quick. And uh, yeah, I kind of like how this looks like. Let's take a step back and just kind of admire that. I like how it's two two layers thick. Like I said, I think that was a good idea. And I think now we just need to do a little bit more to connect them all up. I think if we do something that kind of pushes towards the middle. And we have like something in the middle that's connected to all four pillars. I think it'll really look nice and really bring the base together. And maybe we can connect it up into here. And make it look nice as well. I just want to I just want to kind of complete this base, make it look nice. My goal is to, you know, complete as many projects here as we can before we upgrade because when we go to alpha we're going to be moving on to new terrain and we're kind of we're going to kind of leave this base behind a little bit uh we are going to come back to it and uh you know add stuff to it when uh when we update to future updates so guys add a little bit of design here on the outside and i kind of like it it gives the the build some more dimension i think and i think it looks uh pretty nice it's it's crazy to me how used how uh like used to this cobblestone texture I am because as you guys know in a few updates from now it's gonna change uh pretty significantly to like lighter texture 
yeah i don't know this this old texture is kind of growing on me i kind of like it it kind of works for like uh medieval builds not that we're doing any but i'm just saying i think it would kind of work for those really well uh so we're going to go ahead and add this to every single part of this tower i kind of like how it looks i think it uh i think it adds to it okay guys and here we go all of that completed i put it on each uh each of the corners and it all looks pretty good to me i kind of like how it looks it really adds to the build in my opinion uh i think the next thing we're going to add is working up top now i do need some things to add to the bottom here and i think i want to use some different type of blocks here because this cobble is kind of you know running together and kind of blending in well too so next thing we're going to do as you guys see we have this little gap here so what i did was I filled up the gap with cobblestone and I laid these little things out right here. And what I want to do is like create like a little archway type looking thing here. And that way we have like a little platform where we can just walk through and we can walk in a circle around the whole entire base. Uh, I'm going to try to see if I can use some oak wood with it to break it up a little bit from uh, the cobblestone design. So we're going to see what this looks like, guys. Uh, once more, I came up with something uh, cool to put up top here. I'm liking how this looks, so we're just going to go ahead and just continue this pattern all the way around. And we might actually have a reason to harvest my tree farm now, because that's just been sitting there like that for a while now. So, ladies and gentlemen, here we are. I've built all four of the, uh, I guess, overhangs up or whatever you want to call them. And uh, I think it looks nice. I think it adds to, to the base a lot. See, I was really struggling with what I wanted to do with this base which is part of the reason why I stopped playing this world, amongst other reasons. I just didn't feel like I had uh, the creative buzz I needed. But I think for what you can do in inf dev, this is, this is pretty, uh, this is pretty good. I like how it looks from both the inside part and from the outside. And uh, I mean, it's still a lot of cobblestone, but I think I broke it up a lot more and it feels a lot more uh, lively in here now and a lot more 3D. So I think that is going to be it for our work on the base today. I do want to accomplish one more thing today and I think we're going to do some pixel art. And uh, this is something I did on my old world that I just recently did a tour video on. Uh, we did a uh, Super Mario pixel art. And I think I found a spot for it right here. I mean, this natural dirt patch and everything already kind of has the general shape. And uh, instead of, you know, building it high up, I think we're going to build it just in the ground. And I think this is the spot to do it. I don't want to do another build that's like going up into the sky because we already have this spawn tower, uh, the 10 year sign. I think I, think I just want to keep this kind of here. And then soon we're going to have our house over there once we finally decide to build it. So I think right here is good. Plus it kind of goes together with the 10 years of Minecraft bit over here. So I think we're going to go ahead and get started on it. Here we are. Hell yeah. It's complete. I've done it. The first Minecraft pixel art that was ever posted online. And I built it in my world now for the second time since I did it on the previous world too. But I really like the placement. I actually really like that it's in the uh like in the ground now. I like it better than when it's standing up on its own. Uh let's go get a closer look at it from the new part of the base that we created. And here it is a little bit closer. So you guys can get a better look at it. I'm really happy with uh how this came out. More importantly I'm happy with how my base is coming together now. I still think there's a little bit more work to be done on the outside and on the inside. But I think that's going to be it for this episode. Uh, like I said, I am going to try to do something very special soon for two reasons. One, because you guys got me over 100 subscribers, which is great because I wasn't even active. So I appreciate the love and support. And two, my world... We'll be turning a year old, I believe, on April 8th. Yep, April 8th. So I think I want to celebrate that by doing something really, uh, really spectacular. So stand by for that. And uh, But I think that's going to be it for today, guys. 
Y'all have a good one.